Mannequins and live models filled the coin gallery during the opening of the first annual Conceptual Coverings Fashion Exhibition that took place at Syracuse University on April 4th. The mix of non-traditional and traditional materials and fabrics, along with the setup, made this show different than the average runway show. Instead of using the runway, designers from all different majors had the chance to create an environment for their creations. The show is all about the body and works that relate to the body, whether it's video or, or fashion or performance art. It's not even a fashion show and it's not an art exhibit. It just kind of melds the two together. I met up with two of the designers as they were preparing for the show. Junior sculpture major Lauren Clark says her collection was inspired by her love for plants. Clark created the collection during the fall semester. It's really amazing to create a work of art for a class and then be able to actually show it. But now I feel like this is my like time to like, you know, get it together and make it look the way I really want it to. Freshman fashion design major Samantha Davis told us about her inspiration for her fashion piece. It began as spiders and dragons. I just, I really have this cool connection with um, anything that's long and gangly, whether it's like big wings or long legs, and uh, it eventually turned into more of a Tim Burton style piece. It's just very kind of creepy and eerie, but it still has a beautiful touch to it. Setup took about two days, and just a few hours before the show, designers were prepping their models and putting final touches to their pieces. Moments after the exhibition opened, families, friends, students, and faculty crowded the room. We have a huge variety of interesting pieces to look at, but all which relate to the same topic of the body. Everybody's really happy with it, and the work is wonderful. We haven't come to see any of her work, and, and um, we just hear about these projects, so it, to see them in person is fantastic. Guests had the opportunity to walk around and get a close look at all the work. They also had the opportunity to watch the live performance art pieces. Well, it's, it's so much fun to see the students come together and put a, a gallery situation together. Sophomore textile design major and coordinator for the show, Tim Westbrook, says he was thrilled with the turnout. It was a huge success. Um, like, um, you know, not just personally my piece, but the whole, just the way the entire hallway was activated, and the fact that we were all just so positive going into it, we were all so passionate about it. Like that, just and and when you really truly love something and put effort into that, like it's, it's gonna glow, and people are gonna respond to it. And I, I mean, absolutely they did. Like there were only compliments. I was absolutely inspired by it, and I think all the people who came were inspired by it. 